Ulrich and Johnson made a rare public appearance with daughter Bo, 17. This week the mother and daughter visited patients at Bristol Royal Children's Hospital. They spent time on the cardiac cord on behalf of the British Heart Foundation charity is close to the family's heart as Bo was born with a heart defect in 2000. With her long blonde hair and bright smile, Bo Johnson was the spitting image of her mother Ulrika as she joined her on an appearance this week. The look-like mother and daughter paid a surprise visit to the Bristol Royal Hospital for children to cheer up patients and raise awareness of the British Heart Foundation's BHF Christmas Appeal. It is a charity close to the family's heart as 17-year-old Bo was born with a congenital heart defect and continues to be treated for the condition today. With her long blonde locks and bright smile, the teenager was the spitting image of her TV star mother. They both showed their kind nature as they spent time on the pediatric cardiac ward to hear the stories of young heart patients and to meet some of the BHF's leading researchers to find out how their work is saving lives. Ulrika, 50, a mother of four, told how she was once in the same position as the mothers spending time with their children on the ward. In 2000 Bo was born with a heart condition known as double inlet left ventricle, which meant she had only one working pumping chamber in her heart. Ulrika was told that in order to keep Bo alive she would need a series of three operations, the first at just six days old. Now 17, Bo still takes medication daily and still has to be monitored. Bo is a healthy and active teenager now, but I still remember being given that devastating diagnosis that she had a heart condition and would need surgery just days after she was born, Ulrika said. Ulrika also met with Professor Giovanni Biglino, a biomedical engineer who focuses largely on congenital heart disease. One of his projects is creating 3D models of children's hearts to help parents understand their child's condition and to aid surgeons. Each year, around 4,000 babies like Bo, are diagnosed with a congenital heart defect in the UK, that's 12 babies every day with many more diagnoses later in life. Sadly around 400 of those children die each year before they reach school age. Ulrika continued, it was so inspiring to meet the little fighters on the ward and their families, and to hear about the fantastic research the BHF is undertaking. Their work could truly transform the lives of thousands of children, including Bo. Congenital heart disease doesn't discriminate, it can affect any child. That's why I'm supporting the BHF's Christmas appeal to help the charity fund more research into congenital heart disease. The BHF aims to raise over half a million pounds towards pioneering research into congenital heart disease. Amanda Bringens, director of fundraising at the BHF added, sadly, Many tiny hearts will be struggling this Christmas. That's why we urgently need everyone's support so that we can find new ways to improve survival rates and the lives of children living with a heart condition. We are delighted that Ulrika has chosen to support our Christmas appeal after her daughter's own battle with congenital heart disease and the money raised will mean we can continue to fund the vital research needed to help keep tiny hearts beating.
Visit christmas.bhf.org.uk for more information. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment your opinion, share this video and subscribe to my channel. New videos are uploaded every day.